Alright, so we are back. I just went up to heal my Pokemon. We are looking nice. And our buddy Snek is ready for some battle. So let's put this thing in front. And we're going to head back to um, the Central Park area where I do believe we have a couple more trainers to take care of. And other than that, I don't really know where the hell we're supposed to go <laughs> in this city. The place is kind of a shit show. The taxis don't seem to work, which, you know, is a little bit inconvenient. But I guess, you know, we're staying in shape here just running around. So... We shall go right this way. It's easier to travel in a taxi than on foot. Well, then where the hell are the taxis? Hello? All right, so we did battle you, and we have not battled this guy. I'm on a roll. You'll be my fifth opponent today. Oh, man, this guy's grinding. All right, buddy, let's see what you got. Colt here has one Pokemon, and it's a Hamstar. Nice. <laughs> it's been really putting this Hamstar to work, huh? I like your style. I'm gonna go for a baby doll eyes. That, that's okay, because we're gonna charge beam you. And we do actually get the special attack raise. I believe in Snek. This thing. He may be small now, but I'm sure this thing turns into an absolute unit. I'm gonna go for another baby doll eyes. The, the animation for baby doll eyes does not look anything like baby doll eyes at all. It looks freaking scary. We do get another one, and that doesn't really matter because that's gonna go down. So we're close to level 19. Um, we do need to do some grinding. I don't know kind of what's coming up here, but I guess rather than using the EXP share on one of these two, I think we'll probably just leave it off so Snake can get some more experience. But it looks like we got just a couple more trainers in here. I was taking a stroll, but a battle would be fine. Oh, would it? All right. Taking a stroll, huh? Doesn't seem like the biggest park to take a stroll. Uh, guys, got an ugling. We're going to give you a charge beam. Because I think you're flying type. You got to be, right? Yep, that just knocks it out right in one hit, and we're also going to grow to level 19. We'd be getting special attack raises, like, every time. We do get up to 19, trying to learn Thunderfang. Okay. Okay, I think Charge Beam's probably better. I mean, Thunderfang is 65, but let's get rid of Rap. Ain't nobody got time to be rapping things. So, I think, well, let's check the stats of this thing, actually. I think we have higher special attack. Uh, yeah, so our special attack is not way better. We have 37 and compared to 21 attack, so we'll just be sticking with Charge Beam, it seems. But, you know, we have other options. That outfit is totally cute on you. I think she likes me. I think she likes me, guys. We met her in the park. All right, Missy. She's got a dove heart. That is perfect for us. It's almost like they just made it so you can, like, train up your new <laughs> electric Pokemon you got from the previous route on all these damn flying types. But I am not complaining. We're going to actually just finish you off with a Thunderfang, because that should still kill you. Gust? Really? you gonna, you going to gust me, huh? You know, the thing about uh, the thing about the typing for Snake is he's electric poison. So if anybody has a freaking ground move, we're pretty much dead. Oh, it's one of the, <laughs> the rub ball. It's one of these freaking things. We'll go for a charge beam. I don't know what the hell he wants to really do. We get that special attack. Okay, work up. That's fine. That's totally fine. I love this thing's little face, though. Any Pokemon with a tiny mouth like that, the little smiling face, is hilarious. Doesn't quite knock it out. We get another special attack raise. Would you look at that? And Dizzy Punch does a lot because of the boosts. Okay, that's kind of spooky. We're just going to finish you with a Poison Fang. Okay, thank God we didn't miss because I definitely would have just died. But, oh, we actually get uh, Bouncy. The, that thing has an ability called Bouncy that <laughs> hits you with damage. Oh, interesting. Well, it looks like the... All there really is for the park here. So, um, what are we supposed to... Where am I supposed to be going? I don't think I've... Have I gone over this way? Would you like to hear my favorite story? Sure. All right. Once upon a time, there was an Ugling. Now, Ugling was different from the other Ducklet, so he was called Ugly. When the Ducklet evolved into Swanna, they were stronger, faster, and more beautiful than the Ugling. Then one day, Ugling evolved into a Swite, and the Swanna were so jealous. The end. <laughs> Like the ugly duckling story? Okay, I don't, don't think... I, have I gotten in this house before? Hello, sir. A move which base power depends on the speed of both opponents. Try this. We get TM74 for Gyro Ball. Uh, that's actually a pretty decent steel move, so... I mean, if you have a slow steel type. So that is cool. Um, I think if we go all the way left, I'm pretty sure I have been over this way. Completely powered by electricity. I think in a couple years it can be powered by solar energy. Yeah, we did actually talk to you. Wait, have I talked to you? No, talking about Sunny Shore. I don't think we have. Little Sinnoh reference, huh? How about this place? 
Oh, this is the guy that gave gives us the evolution items. So we don't need you. Um, I don't know where the hell I'm going, but I'm sure there's a place that I've missed in this city, right? City is so fast and hectic. I love it. Can I see your Pokemon? They look strong. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. What are you doing, little kid? Hello? In school, I learned that you have to have eight gym badges to battle the Elite Four and the Champion. Yeah, I don't say. Should I go farther left here? I think there is... I don't think I've gone in this house, have I? I probably have. No, it doesn't seem familiar. Magnet raises the power of Electro-type. Moves awesome, isn't it? Nope, that's the guy that gives us the magnet. Okay, um... Let's try going up this way. So we saw, like, the, the taxi parking area. That was up here somewhere. And, oh, hey, we haven't gone in here yet. Okay. We got, uh, so we're just on the right side of that, that street. There is actually an item right here. We found a paralyzed heel. Thank you for that. Um, and we have some old people chilling. Husband tells every trainer he sees without about Electra defeating him. When we learn that this story is just as, just as boring as he is. A long time ago, there was an electric-type gym leader who gave away gym badges to anyone who already had at least one. Then came a girl with her own batch of electric-type Pokemon. The two made a bet, and the little girl won. She became the new electric-type gym leader. Nice. Well, where the hell is the gym? Is that the gym over there, right there to the left? Probably is. Empty trash can. Rust Bolt, such a big city, you can easily get lost in it. I, yep, yeah, you're right. You sure can, lady. This place is huge. Look just as lively as my boy. That's why I gave him a zuppy of his very own. One day, when he's older, I plan to give him something very special. What's that? You want to know what it is? Well, it's something that'll make it even stronger when it evolves, but that's a secret. Interesting. What's the secret, sir? Okay, so we haven't been in here yet. What do we got here? Oh, okay, so it's this is not the gym. There's just some dudes chilling. Strike! What? This guy on strike? No money, no taxis. Oh my god, maybe I wasn't messing up on the taxis. It looks like these people are on strike. Hello? I'm sorry, but the taxi company is on strike, so there are no taxis around at the moment. Wow, well that makes total sense. Oh, something's happening. Something's going on. I'll tell you why we're on strike. You see, our boss doesn't pay us enough, so we won't work for him until he raises our pay. If you want to find him, he'll be at the Central Park. He goes there to battle trainers. I'm going there now to talk to him again. Alright, so apparently we got to go back to the Central Park. They just got us running all around in this damn place. Um, we might have to battle that guy, so I think it's probably a good idea for us to get a heal up before we do so. Um, we do not want to go that way. That's the beginning of the city. If we just head over to the right, the Poké Center should be right here. We're going to get nice and healed. Um, if we have to battle their boss, he's probably going to be pretty damn scary. And I don't know if that's... Am I ready for that? Is that something I should be doing? <laughs> I feel like I should grind up a little bit more. My team is kind of a little bit bad at the moment. We do have Charlotte, though. I mean, as long as... As long as we've got Charlotte, we're in pretty good shape. But, Snek does need some levels. Um, we need a freaking Evolve Happy. But I, I know that there was actually an area where we can leave the city over here to the right. Let's see if we can go anywhere new over this way. Okay, here it is. What's popping? Hello, sir. Oh, he's, he's running around. Don't move. I'm cleaning the gateway. Come again later. Well, all right. So, you literally cannot leave the city. And that means that we're headed to the Central Park. Oh, wow, I actually ran right there. Perfect. What's going on over here? Oh, man, they're fighting. Looking tense over here. Rustbolt City can't function without taxis, and we won't work until you raise our pay. Why should I? Oh, my God, this guy just looks evil. Look at this guy's face. <laughs> because we work hard all day, every day, and we deserve it. If you raise our pay, we'll get back to working. Forget it. Oh, he ain't having it. Oh, he pushed me. He just pushed a child. Watch out, kid. Man, this guy is salty. Jesus. Sorry, buddy. I'm sorry you had to see that. He's just not listening. Maybe you can have a word with him. I think that he'll be back in his office in the taxi company. Well, it looks like we are about to have to battle that guy for people. Oh, Jesus. Um, are we ready to do this? Maybe we should run... <laughs> Maybe we should grind up, like, a little bit. We could, we could. The only place we could go... Is, I guess, just back to um, the route where we came from. But, oh, Jesus, I went the wrong I went the wrong damn way. I, I'd be getting lost out here. I wonder if the taxis actually eventually come back. They should. Okay, so ooh, there's a Pokeball right there. I would have missed that. That is, ooh, a Thunderstone. Nice. So, not sure what we can use a Thunderstone on. I don't think we can use it on Snick. We might as well try it. I don't know why I don't think so, but... 
Could potentially... Nope, not available. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, Alright. You know what? Razor Claw and Razor Fang. One of these, they actually increase crit ratio. So we could actually give this to... We could definitely use that. Let's give that to Happy. And then what is the Razor Fang? Razor Fang, um, more likely to flinch. I think the crits is probably more useful. So, alright, let's head over this way and down. We might as well get, like, a level or two. We also have a rare candy we could use, I suppose. So, Snake is level 19. I think getting up to 20 would just make me feel a little bit a little bit better about what we're about to get ourselves into. So, let's, uh, let's get a little bit of a grinding session here. It's kind of unfortunate because... It's all going to be like, oh, no, never mind. We got freaking bushes here. Level 13 bush. We're almost level 20. I might even just get it up to level 20. Oh, I fucking used a Leer on accident. Damn it. Well, we're going to lower your defense, bush. That's right. Just going to go for some growth. That is fine. We're going to poison fang you. And, uh, obviously killed you. Probably not going to get too much experience from this damn little bush. But we might as well try to get up at least one level. And then I do have a rare candy, right? Thought I had a rare candy. It's in medicine, actually. Yeah, we do have one rare candy. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get up to level 20, then we're immediately gonna use the rare candy, and we're gonna be sitting pretty pretty nice. I should really probably be grinding up the other members of my team, like freaking Dracula and Maniac, but they'll get some treatment eventually. I'm just training in this game takes a little bit long because there's no access to like a speed up button or anything, uh, which is kinda lame, but We'll be doing some grinding eventually. Zuppy's gonna be hurt by its poison, which is kind of just a damn waste of time because another one would have killed it. Consider yourself zigzagged, Zuppy. Okay, one more kill here, and we're gonna be up in fighting shape. I really don't know what this freaking boss is gonna throw at us, but I'm afraid. Oh, Jesus, it's a razid. Okay, um, you know what? For some reason, I don't like this thing. We're gonna switch. We're gonna let, uh,. We're going to let Charlotte do it because it probably has some type of electric move, which Happy does not like. We hate electric moves. Sand attack. Jesus. Throws the sand from the sky? My god. OP. We're going to bug bite you, which does knock you out. So we should go over level, grow level here. Yep, we're level 20. Looking good. And now it is time to use this rare candy. Might as well, might as well just use it. And we'll just bump you right up to level 21. Use your last rare candy. All right. Kind of hoping for an evolution there. That would have been great timing. But it doesn't happen. It's okay, though. And we are ready to pretty much just go take on the boss. Everybody's, yep, still full. Just making sure. So we got to find our way back to... Oh, it's actually right up this way. I'm learning my way around this place. Okay, so we're back at the office. Well, what's going down over here, fellas? We're on strike. Krusty Krab is unfair. Mr. Krabs is in there. Rust Bolt is so big that it needs taxi drivers. I'm aware of that, yes. A taxi can drive you wherever you want, but the drivers don't get paid very well, so that's the reason for the strike. I'm familiar with the, the reason for the strike. I, I'm very well, well versed in this situation, sir. Okay, these guys are just chilling. I'm not driving at the moment, so I have time for a battle. Oh, okay, this guy just doesn't give a fuck. He's like, you know what? I'm not getting paid, so let's just battle inside and ruin this place. This guy's got a tad art. Level 17, this thing is grass poison type. I believe we're gonna go into happy and uh, we are actually weak to grass moves unfortunately but we should be okay it's gonna go for a water pulse that's fine as long as you don't confuse me we're good yeah we're good all right um, so Aurora beam should do the trick here doesn't this thing have grass moves what the hell well we're just gonna pee on you sorry about that froggy it does knock you out little frogger boy so happy is still relatively useful when we don't need it to run from things. <laughs> Alright, what are you doing, guy? This is the recreation room. Normally we go there in our breaks, but because of the strike, we're sitting here the whole day. And he's going to battle us as well. So it looks like we do have three battles here, which is kind of nice. A little bit of extra experience before... Ooh, he's got an Arak Aquad. Aquad. Well, we can give you a charge beam. I definitely killed... I killed my roundhouse. I still feel bad about it. And uh, I'm sorry, buddy. Okay, next is a Gekkon. Okay, Gekkon, these things are psychic types, so we don't want to heck with this. Um, unfortunately, Charlotte doesn't really like psychic type either, but I'm pretty sure we could take at least one attack from it. So we'll go into Charlotte here. Spinning in a nice little web. 
Okay, level 16. Uh, we'll just go for a bug bite. Probably just knock it out in one hit. Charlotte doesn't take no shit from geckos. Down you go, little Spider-Man gecko. And Josh has been defeated. Get ourselves some money, and it looks like we have one more guy. The boss has his office in the upper floor, but you have to battle me first. Okay, so it looks like after this battle, we're going to head upstairs, and then we have the boss battle, which is frightening. But Jimmy over here has a Floby, and that's actually perfect for Snick, because we can just give you a nice little, little charge beam, because I think this thing's flying type. If I remember correctly, yep. That is going to kill you. We should definitely heal before we take on this boss. Lot pug. Um, that's the freaking thing with the... Yep. <laughs> it's with the hands. Alright, uh, I believe this thing's fairy type, so Poison Fang should... Okay, it's a nice little 2 KO. Of course we get infatuated by its cute charm. I don't know, I don't know about that. This thing doesn't look too cute to me. It's fucking, it's scary looking. Like, look at those hands. And Snake is, of course, immobilized by love. Bruh, how are you in love with this ugly ass thing? Please, snap out of it, buddy. Snap out of it. You got this, Snake. You got this. And, oh my god, immobilized two times in a row. Infatuation is OP. Let this be a lesson. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try this again. You got it, buddy. Jeez, it three times in a row? What is going on here? More trick shots, that's totally fine. We can stay in here and take this all day. Okay, Snake, if you don't hit this thing another time, you're getting released. Oh my god, never mind. We're not actually gonna release yet, but it was supposed to be an incentive. This thing doesn't give a fuck. He's just not gonna hurt this lob hug. Please, come on, come on. Oh my god. Is Cute Charm broken in this game? What's going on here? We're gonna literally, we're just gonna keep trying until we can fucking hit this thing. Oh my Jesus, what is going on? We're gonna like die from these trick shots. Well, we're just gonna switch out, Snake, because you clearly don't wanna kill your fucking lover. My God. That was annoying, <laughs> what the hell? All right, Happy, you can do it though. You don't give a shit about no lop hug. Oops, almost, almost tried to switch out again. We're just gonna finish you with an Aurora Beam. Oh my God, Charm, I'm gonna lower my attack. That's totally fine, we're just gonna pee on you. So you deserve that. Oh, I didn't even kill it. Why don't I use quick attack? The world may never know. But we're okay. Because that's going to knock it out. And uh, we're good. Jesus, that thing was annoying as shit to kill. The boss is stronger than me. Okay, that is not what I like to hear. Because boss battles in this game are freaking scary. It's essentially going to be like a gym battle for us. We're going to run back. Going to get a nice little heal up before we take this on. Because we need all the help we can get. I feel like I should probably even still be grinded up on my team a little bit more. But YOLO, we're just going to go right for it. Look at him wagging his little tail. <laughs> Alright, so here's the Poké Center. A one last heal before shit gets serious. Hello, ma'am. It's me again. Yes, we don't need to go through this whole shindig every time. Just take my damn Pokémon and heal him up. We also really need to catch something new. We'll see you again. Alright. Time to do it. I guess we'll just lead off with... Uh... I guess we'll just lead off with this thing. I don't know. No idea what this guy's going to have, but, you know, he's got a lot of money, so he's probably bought some crazy Pokemon. Let's get it. We just got to run all the way back to the top. Seems like a large office for a taxi company. I don't really know what would be going on in here, but... All right. Our last set of stairs, at least I assume. And, all right, so there he is, just having a nice little meeting with this guy. Not looking happy. I said no. Why should I raise your wages? You know, I need the money for training my Pokemon. Boss, I know that, but we work hard all day and night. It would just be for, would just be a little for all our hard work. Seems honest. And about your Pokemon, why haven't? Why don't you train them yourself? Have you forgotten how much fun it is to take care of your own Pokemon? Yeah, guy. My Pokemon need this training. I want to take part in the next Makoto League, so they have they have to be strong. And I really don't have the time to train them myself. Well, that's messed up, man. That's not how this works. Hey, it's you, the trainer from Central Park. It, it me. A trainer? You don't look like one. Well, rude, sir. What? You're collecting gym badges to take part in the Rakoto League, too. Don't make me laugh. The Rakoto League is not intended for little kids like you. You asshole. Boss, how about this? You battle this kid, and if you win, we end the strike and go back to work with our current pay. But if you lose, you must raise our wages. Man, really just putting this all on me, huh? Are you sure? Do you really think I can lose to this kid? This is a bet I can't lose. Come on, kid. I'll show you the strength of my Pokemon. All right. 
Time to get this money. We're battling the Clerk Lex. He has three Pokemon. And he leads off with a Stotox, which is actually fine. We're not really too afraid of this thing. It's only level 17. So, hey, we're actually in a pretty good spot here. We'll go for a Charge Beam. And it doesn't quite knock it out, but we get ourselves a special attack boost, which is great. Hits us with a Smackdown. And uh, we're just going to finish it with another Charge Beam, buddy. That's right. One down, two to go. We also get another special attack raise. Hell yeah. All right, we're set up here. We're going to grow to level 22 there as well, trying to learn Acid Spray. Is that what nullifies the ability of the opponent? What, are you, what is Acid Spray again? No, it reduces the target special defense stat. Why do I forget what that is every time? Well, we're... I guess we... Sh I guess we could teach that. I mean, could be kind of could be kind of nice. It's essentially like setting up special attack, but you know, let's get rid of Leer for that. Why not? Acid spray works out better than Leer. Next is a Platy Plat. Um. Okay, I know that I've seen Platy Plat when I when I look up the Pokemon for the layout. I'm pretty sure I clicked on Platy Plat. I think this is a ground. This thing's got to be ground type, right? I'm I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I checked this thing out. Platy Plat's a fucking ground type, and Snick is absolutely allergic to ground. Um, as much as I want to stay in here, I, I just don't trust it. I, I think I've seen that this thing's ground type. It's brown as hell. It's got to be a ground type. We're switching the hell out of here. Um, let's go into Happy in that case. We'll see. Well, I, I guess we'll see. Might have been a better idea just to stay in there and save that special attack boost, but oh, jeez. Okay, Platy Plat, level 17. And uh, let's see if you like Water Pulse. I'm this thing seems like it would be a water type, right? I don't know. Let me go for a mud shot. Yo, it is actually. Okay. I'm sh pretty sure if Snek got hit with that, we would have died. <laughs> we actually get the confusion too. Oh my god, that was actually super clutch. So wait. What the hell type is this thing, man? It is confused. It goes for water ground. Is this thing water ground? I think it's a water ground type. That's actually a great typing. Well, we knocked that thing out. And uh, next is a glowing. Have I seen what the hell is a glowing? Hello? Um it has wing in its name, so it's gotta be a something flying. Let's go into Snick. Have I seen glowing before? Why does that ring a bell? Oh my Jesus! We have not seen this thing before. And that thing is crazy as hell looking. Um, alright. Well. Before we get too far into this, I I don't know what type this thing is. I have no idea what it's going to do. We're going to go for a potion here just to scout out what this thing wants to go for. Might have been a better move for me to just stay in here. It's going to go for a string shot. Gee, okay. This thing looks badass, though. I really like this thing's design. Let's go for a charge beam. It's got to be flying type. It's going to confuse Ray. Yo. This thing is just a menace. Okay. Please, Snek, if this is anything like your infatuation. Okay, great. We break through. We land a charge beam, and it does nothing. Well, that is interesting what the hell type is this thing let's go over a let's try a poison bang it's just gonna tackle okay this thing does not have the best of move sets of course we hit ourselves in confusion um what what the fuck what should i do here do i go into charlotte it just has it's just tackled us so far let's go into charlotte i'm trying to by the look of this thing i can't Okay, struggle bug. That's fine. So we should be easily able to defeat this thing. Lowers. Oh, lowers my special attack. That's 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 fine. That's totally fine. Let's go for a bite. And get a flinch. How about that? Yeah, we do get the flinch. All right, a couple more bites gonna do the trick. And yo, this thing is awesome though. I do really. I remember somebody mentioned something about a glowing Pokemon in one of the houses. This has got to be what they were referring to. We, oh, we have actually seen. No, this is what the the little glowy thing. This that's what it turns into. We've for sure seen the little baby version of this thing. Well, we're able to knock it out with another bite. And down you go. So, Clerk Lex has been defeated. What? I've lost? Yep, you gotta pay these people some more money. How did I lose? You're, a str you're stronger than you look. My Pokemon may be strong, but it feels like they don't belong to me. I think I should train them myself, as I did when I was younger. There you go, buddy. That's the spirit. Guess I have to raise their pay now. You sure do. You did it. Thank you so much, trainer. Thanks to you, the Rust Bolt Taxi Company can get back in business. For your help, please take this. And, hey, we got a bike voucher. Nice, so we can actually go grab a free bike. Hell yeah. Take this voucher to the bike store, and you'll get a free bike. Nice. Well, it looks like our work here is done. We got the workers some some more money. We got a bike voucher. 
and things are moving along here. I guess now we'll probably be able to move over to the right in that new route over that way. So I guess there's not a gym in the city. That's kind of like all there is to do. We help out the taxi company. Maybe we can ride a taxi now. Everybody's gone, so maybe they're out in the streets. Oh, what's going on here? Hello, sir. Hello, my name is Buck. I'm one of the taxi drivers in the city. We heard that you're the one who got the boss to raise the salaries for us drivers. I feel really grateful to you. We arranged it so that you can drive with the Rust Bolt City taxis for free. Hey, let me show you what you have to do. Follow me. All right, so we get a free taxi rides. Have to go to the right side of one of the taxi signs, turn down, and press enter. Then you can decide where you want to go. Nice. Okay, and then a taxi shows up. If you need a taxi, just whistle. I'll be there. All right, cool. So we have to go here and hit enter. Oh, oh, Jesus. Anytime this guy shows up, we do not have a good time. Have you seen this? The taxis are back in the city. Wonder who solved the problem for the company with the company boss. Never mind, huh? What's that? A bicycle voucher. Just go get a bike from the bike shop. You'll need one to get the cycling path, which leads you to Brushes Town. That's where I'm going next. But first, I have to win my third gym badge. See you soon, Hayden. Okay, thank God he doesn't battle us. I'm afraid every time we fucking see that guy. Uh, so, okay, we'll go here. We'll hit enter. Where do you want to go? We want to go to the bike shop. And a taxi conveniently shows up and takes us right to the bike shop. So that's actually pretty cool. So here we are. This guy says he has nothing in stock. You have a bike voucher. I'm sorry, but the next consignment comes in a few hours. Maybe you could do something in the meantime. Well, okay. We don't get a bike yet, apparently, because this guy's a dickhead. But we're just going to head over here to the right, and I guess we can just go into the next route. Also, we should definitely heal up, just to make sure that we're in fighting shape for whatever we come across. I wonder where the... I mean, the bike place is probably, or the, the bike path or whatever, it's got to be over there to the right. doesn't seem like there's anywhere else for us to go. So that should be interesting to figure out, but that's the fun of playing an entirely new game. I have no idea what's going on. We almost got creamed right there with that guy on the bike. But all right, so now we can see if this guy's done with his cleaning. Oh, are you done? He's not done. Don't move, I'm cleaning the gateway. Coming in later. Well, what, what hello? Which way am I supposed... Which way am I supposed to go? What the fuck's up with that? Um, I don't think we can go north anyway, right? Doesn't seem like there was anywhere else for us to go. Oh wait, no, I haven't gone this way. Rust Bolt Landfill. I totally could have actually gone here earlier. What is this? Got the landfill, huh? Oh, Jesus, okay. This is no place for a kid. Time for you to scram. Time for me to scram, huh? Spoken like a true grandpa. Janitor Mateo has a fever. Um, what do I want to do against this thing? Do we just charge beam? What the fuck was fever again? Okay, well, we almost knock you out. Poison gas. That's fine. Doesn't affect me, you dummy. And we'll just kill you with the Thunderfang. Because why the hell not? All right. So it looks like we got... A couple janitors to beat here. Maybe if we beat them, they'll just tell their friend to let me through. But look at this play. This place is a dump. Literally, we find a full heal here. But, uh, alright guys. Well, we're going to end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button on this video if you enjoyed. It really helps out the series. And Snake is always going to be holding something. We get a hyper potion from him. Nice. I should really check that more often, I feel like. But, anyway guys, I will see you next time. Peace out.